During his two-day official visit to the Netherlands, French President Emmanuel Macron will deliver a speech summarizing his vision for the future of Europe. Amsterdam, French President Emmanuel Macron will deliver a speech outlining his vision for the future of Europe during his two-day official visit to the Netherlands on Tuesday. The afternoon speech at a theater in The Hague came after Macron raised eyebrows at his comments on Taiwan following recent visit to China. The question we have to answer as Europeans is, is it in our interest to accelerate in Taiwan? Macron was quoted as saying Sunday in the French newspaper Les Echos and in an interview published by Politico Europe. The worst would be to think that we Europeans should follow suit and take our cue from the US agenda and China's overreaction. The statements raised questions about whether Macron's views were aligned with European Union's position and whether Bloc of 27th could become third superpower that Macron says he hopes to build in a few years. The interview was Friday, before China launched large-scale combat exercises around Taiwan simulating closure of the island in response to Taiwan's president's trip to United States last week. Macron stressed the concept of strategic autonomy for Europe, which he has been advocating for years. He warned of what he called a trap that would lead the bloc to get caught in crises that weren't ours. China and Taiwan separated in 1949 after a civil war. The government in Beijing says the island has to forcibly rejoin the mainland if necessary. Macron's trip to Amsterdam The Hague is first state visit by a French leader since Jacques Chirac 23 years ago underlines close ties between Netherlands France two leaders. After arriving Amsterdam, Macron Dutch King Willem Alexander inspected Guard of Honor as a military band played and French Dutch flags fluttered in strong breeze the square outside the capital's royal palace. After Guard of Honor and before Macron lays wreath at National Monument near Palace in city's historic center, a small group protesting Macron's pension reforms briefly unfurled banner that reads, We won't be, in French. Beaten to retire. Macron then traveled to The Hague to meet with the leaders of both houses of the Dutch Parliament before giving his speech. In the evening, Macron and his wife Bridget returned to Amsterdam for a banquet hosted by Willem Alexander. Macron's itinerary on Wednesday includes visiting a science park in Amsterdam, meetings with Prime Minister Mark Rutte, and watching a blockbuster exhibition of paintings by Dutch master Johannes Vermeer at the Rijksmuseum. Korter reported from The Hague.